Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing from beautiful Santa Anita Park on Monday, January the 2nd, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle Southern California race of the day. Let's take a look at the race 8 featured this afternoon, folks, 4.07 p.m. Pacific Post Time. This is the Monrovia Stakes, six and a half furlong sprint on Santa Anita's unique downhill turf course, grade 3 fillies and mares, four years old and up, racing for a $100,000 purse. Contenders number 10, Unzip Me, number 1, Ms. Direction, number 2, Gavine, and number 9, Separate Forest. Number 10, Unzip Me, has won 10 of 16 in her career to date, sprinting at her about 6.5 furlongs on the grass. Is the overall speed leader, has turned in power on performances. Five straight starts hitting the board in four of those adventures, including a pair of power run wins being embedded in this recent streak of racing consistency. Jockey Rafael Bejarano has been in her irons on 11 previous occasions, hitting the board in 10 of those efforts, winning 7 times. Back today for ride number 12. Number 1, Ms. Direction, a 9-2 shot as the pace profile leader, has also hit the board in 4 of her last 5, winning in both her last start as well as in her third race back. Race 8 summary, number 10 on Zip Me, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 1, Ms. Direction, number 2, Govine, and number 9, Separate Forest, 10129, in the 8th from Santa Anita, the $100,000 Grade 3, Monrovia Stakes. Bonus long shots, let's go to Turf Paradise first. Race number one, the 4 to 1 shot, number 2, Payment Approved, takes a big class drop, 16 units. The overall speed leader in his allowance field, sprinting at five furlongs on the dirt. Portland Meadows, race eight, five to one shot. Number three, I'll be a monkey's uncle. Trackmaster plus power pony qualifier has hit the board in power run fashion in four of his last five, including a power run win in his third race back. So handicapping from Santa Anita on a Monday, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.